Today, we will install the Windows 11 LTSC version without any pen drive. But before we begin, let me explain what the Windows 11 LTSC version is. Windows 11 LTSC is a specialized, variant of the operating system, designed for long-term, stability, and reliability. It's ideal for mission-critical systems and devices that require minimal updates and changes. And the best part is, Windows LTSC have very low system requirements, TPM 2.0 and Secure Boot is optional. So, without wasting any time, let's get started. First, open your browser and search for Windows 11 LTSC. Then, proceed with the first result. For download the ISO, you need to fill up this form. After fill up, click on Download Now. Then choose X64 ISO. Downloading is started now. After the download is complete, close the browser. Now, you have three options to start the installation. First option, open the file manager, navigate to the downloads and right-click on the ISO file. Then, choose extract file, select desktop, create a new folder and click OK. Close the file manager, then open the LTSC folder. Right-click on setup and select run as administrator. Choose to change the setup downloads, select not right now and click next. Accept the terms, and when prompted on what to keep, select nothing and click next. After clicking the install button, your installation will be started. Second op option, open the start menu, search for disk partition and open it. Then, right click on the C drive and select shrink volume. Enter 10,000 and click shrink. After that, right click on the new 10 gigabytes drive and proceed with next until you reach the prompt to enter a drive name. Use this name during the installation process to identify the drive. After complete, close the disk management. Open File Manager, navigate to Downloads, right-click on the LTSC ISO and choose Extract File. Then, select the 10 GB drive and click OK. After completion, close File Manager and open the Start menu. Search for Reset this PC, open it, and proceed with Advanced Restart. Go with Troubleshoot, select the Advanced option and then Command Prompt. Choose your account, if you have set a password on your PC, enter it to continue. If you haven't set a password, like me, simply click Continue. Once the Command Prompt opens, type Notepad and press Enter. Click on File, then Save. Choose this PC, expand it, drop down, save as type, and set it to All Files. Now, open your 10 GB drive, go to Sources, find Setup, and run it as administrator. This will take some time to load the installation files. Click on Next, then Accept Terms, and proceed with a custom install. Now, delete the small partition and the C drive. After that, you will see one unallocated space at the top. Simply select it and click Next. The installation will then begin. I am not showing this just because. For show the third option. The third option is similar to the second one. With an additional step, you need the EasyBCD software. The download link for this software is available on my Telegram channel. Simply right-click on the software and select Run as Administrator, then proceed with Next until it's installed. Afterward, click Go and OK, then OK again. Now, close the file manager and click on Add New Boot Entry. Then, proceed with WinPE. Then set the path. Click on this PC and open your 10 GB drive. Navigate to Sources, select Boot.vim and open it. Next, click on the green plus icon and wait for the success message. Now, click on Edit Boot Menu, ensure the 30-second countdown is enabled, and then click on Save Settings. Close EasyBCD and restart your PC. After restarting, you'll see two boot options. Use the down arrow to select and press Enter. The installation will begin, simply click Next repeatedly, agree to the terms, and accept. 
Delete the small, MB partitions and the C drive but be careful, do not touch the 10 gigabytes drive. Afterwards, you'll see unallocated space at the top, select it and click Next. When the Windows 11 LTSC name appears, click Install. The installation will take approximately 15 to 20 minutes, depending on your disk's read-write speed. During the installation process, your system will automatically restart several times, but there is no need for concern. Select your country and yes. Next, choose your keyboard layout, skip the second keyboard option. I don't have internet. Enter your username and continue. At this step, you have the option to set a password, but if you prefer not to, simply proceed to the next step. Now, adjust your privacy settings, I usually disable all options. After that, you've successfully installed the Windows 11 LTSC version without using a pen drive. The system only includes essential apps, with 141 background processes and a RAM usage of 2GB, which is quite efficient. That's it for today's video. If you like this type of videos, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Stay tuned.